I am giving away 10 copies of Destiny 2. If you wish to be entered, make sure you hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell next to it, hit the like button on this video, leave me a comment and check the link in the video description for many other optional ways to increase your chances of winning. Good luck. Welcome back guardians to a destiny 2 video quick little video to show you guys mods weapon mods armor mods shaders ship shaders everything and above so if you're excited for destiny 2 hit that like button on this video subscribe if you're new all that great stuff let's get into it so as a titan i got the sweet business exotic auto rifle we're just gonna take a quick look at it look at how badass it is it's awesome it's pretty damn cool look at it um and i'm gonna do like a full review on these weapons you know in the next couple of days so keep an eye out for them so let's just go and take a quick look over here at the weapon the death stalker for au this is an auto rifle feels very much like an smg to me but if it's a pretty awesome weapon so let's have a look at mods and such things that are down here so for instance because this is a secondary weapon or at least it's in the secondary slot i can have a solar damage mod which means that you know this mod section is going to be for you know elemental damages maybe something else as well that we don't know so far but if you've got like a solar damage mod a void damage mod an arc damage mod you can switch between with this weapon so you can always have this weapon on if you like it and then change between each one depending on what enemies you are fighting so it's very much you find a weapon you like find the perks that you like you know you enjoy it but you need it for an arc you need it for an arc nightfall you can put arc on it and then you can run around and batter people with it we also have the shader slots which is over here quite a few shaders available for each weapon um the legendary infusion is just so that you can infuse items but there is more here so what it looks like is that you get three separate weapon mods one of them is the shader slot and then the other two you can switch between you know all the different things that will be available in the full game so let's have a quick look right here at this intrinsic perk rapid fire frame deeper ammo reserves slightly faster reload when magazine is empty so you know i hear that the intrinsic perk will change apparently um who knows but again i'm going to be doing reviews on all these weapons i just wanted to show you the weapon mods and how they work let's go have a quick look over here at the armor because armor now also has mods as well so again you get a shader slot so each and every armor piece that you find that you like that you want to wear you can put a shader on it that you wish and it looks like you can put like a shader on the helmet and then a different shader on the chest piece so each section will have its own shader and then we have armor mods unfortunately this one is empty but i'm guessing if you look at the weapons and you can get a solar damage mod some of the mods that are going to be in the armor section will probably be able to defend you against solar or defend you against arc or defend you against void and then a bunch of other mods that we haven't seen yet again legendary infusion as well um so yeah that's pretty cool there's going to be different sections for different pieces of armor so you can have different shaders on different parts so everyone's going to look different everyone's going to have variety and customization now if i go down here to the ship this is the last thing i want to show you in this very short video is that you can also have vehicle mods and that means you can have a shader a hacker history polish is what is on this um ship that we have right here i'm guessing the same will work with sparrows as well there'll be sparrow shaders but you know what this means is that each and every one ship even though you have the same frame will look different because of the shader but why would they do this in my opinion when you look at destiny uh, ships weren't used for anything other than sitting in orbit so i'm hoping that ships are going to be a major part of the game now so that we can actually show off the shaders and stuff that we have um so yeah pretty damn awesome i'm enjoying the beta so far i'm going to be streaming it in a couple of hours so make sure you stick around and i'll upload a video saying i'm live now actually i haven't checked the ghost let me check the ghost ghost shell mods so the shaders for the shell the ghost shells as well and i got random mods random mods hmm so yeah anyway thank you for watching hit the like button all that great great stuff subscribe if you're new around here for daily destiny 2 content enter the competition the link is down below in the video description thank you for watching i've been easy now and you guys have been awesome